Okay, well, you want to do one real quick? Sure. So, so, our, so, so my things are always immersive, bro. It's all about immersion, right? So mm -hmm. every, and everyone's unique. So I can't tell you how something else was because the people involved and everything, the circumstances are always unique, right? Different people, different situations, right? So us three, let's do something. You guys ready? Yep. Let's do it. Okay. So there's three parts, right? We're going to like open up our boat cords and then we're going to laugh, right? And we're going to see also like between faking and real, like, can you, like, let's see if you could be aware, self-aware where that bridge happens. Okay. You ready? Cool. And the listeners can try it too. Okay. So here we go. We're all going to look at our watches, three parts. We're going to look at our watches. Oh, by the way, before I start with this, we're going to look at our watches, but first, this is for like when you're late or like if somebody else is late. I, by the way, Arjun, like Jay, have you guys ever been late? I oh, have. Yeah. Certainly. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, not pleasant. It, yeah. Not pleasant. What happens when you stress out or worry? Do you go? Does it? Does it? Do you get there faster? No. no. But like, why do we do it? Like everybody fucking does it. Does it? It's true. It's true. Does I, it help uh, you? Does it help your immune system? No, I'm getting flashbacks right now to uh, when I had to report for work at 7 a.m. Uh, that was <laughs> that was quite Whoa. a time in life. <laughs> 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 so you know what i'm talking about dude i've been i've been a teacher too waking up early in the mornings and like being on time and and, and also teaching in that way like stopping like if i'm teaching a subject at like nine o'clock i gotta stop that and even though the questions and the flow is happening anyways um now let me let me share this with you guys here's what we're gonna do to hack that we're gonna hack this that with the laughter okay when we're late the next time right also does it ever help when we're stressing out when somebody else is late because you guys do a podcast sometimes somebody else is late does it help when we stress and somebody else is late? No. No. Ever. Does it ever help to stress? No. <laughs> no. Like, does, any, it does anybody even feel better to get there on time? Like if somebody does hurry up and show up, are they happy about it? <laughs> like, yeah. <laughs> get a tap on the back right there. Yeah. Or pat on no. the shoulder. <laughs> no, fuck that, dude. No way, bro. Oh, shit. Can I say that? Are we rated? Are we a rated NC-17? No, we're good, man. Yeah, we're good. Yeah. You're all good. This is, if you rise laterally, you can rise laterally in any direction. We'll have to do a talk about Kama Sutra and the geishas and that stuff one day. But, um, but anyways, so check this out, guys. Here we go. Watch. First, bit, first part is watch, right? Mm -hmm. Second part is running, okay? We're going to be like, oh, we're hurrying up. We're getting there, okay? Like, we're, gonna, we're Russian now, okay? Okay. Not Russian like the people. Okay, we're Russian, okay? <laughs> yep. Unless you want to be you. Russian. That's cool. I don't, you know, I'll, much respect. Okay? So, we're going to... We're going to watch and we're going to run, but we're going to make something with our vocal. You're going to copy me vocally. All right. You guys and everybody listening. You guys ready? Okay. Do it. You'll hear me. Just follow me. Okay. And then, okay. And, then and then we're going to, there's one part, two part, and then we're going to laugh it off because we're rushing. And we're going to let it go. Okay. You ready for this? Let's yep. do it. All right. Here we go. Here we go. Uh, uh, <laughs> oh my gosh <laughs> awesome awesome nice that was good i feel better i feel light yeah, so, let's do this. So, so now my challenge for all y'all out there, mind you, I don't know what the fuck I'm doing. Okay. So I don't know. You guys got to do the experiment, right? So like you tell me, am I bullshitting or am I like saying, am I like speaking some sort of truth? So next time you're late and next time somebody else is late, see if you can laugh, just do a laughter thing and just see how you feel. Does it just check it out. Be self-aware in that space. Totally. Yeah, no, it really speaks to like the mind body connection. A lot of people think of you know, the information flowing from the mind to the body, but it shows how it, information can flow the other way. When the body is laughing, it makes the mind lighter and happier and get involved in a positive way as well. It's really fascinating. I definitely think you're onto something there. Well, let me ask you, how do you guys feel right now? Like, t like t tell me, yeah. like, how are you feeling? Buzzing, you know, like I got yeah. my heart rate up. I feel like I got a little mini workout in right there, <laughs> which is what they talk about in laughter. Like, what is it? If you laugh a hundred times a day, it's the equivalent of doing 10 minutes of rowing. Like right now, I feel like I'm buzzing. Totally. So, so do you understand how many, like how much neurotransmitters you're blasting into your, how much dopamine you just like release? We just got high, bro. We, everybody, even the listeners out there, we, dude, we should charge people for this. Come on. It's like free, <laughs> free drugs, bro. 
Um, but that's a, that's a good point right there because like it is a dopamine release. It is a way for us to hack the you know, substance abuse or dopamine abuse. Now it's just, we're all almost suffering from it. If I were to analyze the situation. Absolutely. Yeah. And I think you shared a statistic in one of your videos too, about like how often babies laugh. Do you remember that? Yep. Yep. That kind of blew my mind. Can you, yep. you share it with our audience? Yeah, dude. Uh, babies laugh over 300 times a day on average. Wild. Babies. I do not laugh 300 times a day anymore. That's for sure. But the question is, what is happening to a baby? Like, we were all babies. What was happening in our brain, our body, nervous system, bones, muscle? What was happening, bro? Tell me. So, yeah, I think actually scientists have proven that uh, it's a way to build your immune system. So that's why a baby can laugh 300 times a day on average without learning it as a behavior. So if you look between the lines or behind the lines, it's like, are they developing a stronger immune system? because they're now in a world of new threats. Why are you saying they, bro? You oh, were yeah. a baby. Exactly. <laughs> Still am. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I mean, I think about too, like religiously, like spiritually, I've done a lot of, I've, I've really loved like pro going back and forth between like deep spirituality and deep science, right? And going and connecting those laterally. And for me, what I've discovered is like, dude, you see it also with like the mystics and the teachers, they say like, connect with your inner child in the Bible, it says be like a child and you shall enter heaven, like over and over and over again. And many spiritualities, it, it says like happiness, joyfulness, being like a child it doesn't say fuck a child. It says be like a child. That's the problem. Like all these spaces where all these powerful people are getting it wrong, right? But we got to bring this awareness for it. I don't know how to, I think laughter, I think joyfulness, I think psychedelics, I think storytelling, I think um, inventive, like innovative technologies are a way we can like start to be like, hey, look, there's more. You want to get power? Do you want to feel power? Dude, let me show you this power. There's a better power than what you got right now. Like it's, it feels better and even you feel better and everybody fucking loves you, bro. They build statues for you, you know? They'll remember you and honor you. That's a thing, right? Absolutely, man.